multiply and then simplify completely. So what we're doing is the FOIL process, first, outer, inner, last. So we want to multiply square root of 5 times square root of 5, which is the square root of 25 or just 5. Because you multiply the 5's together and that's 25, but the square root of 25 is just 5. And then we want to multiply that first square root of 5 times the square root of 7, and we get the square root of 35. Now we'll do the inner, the inside ones, and I'm going to get plus 7 root 35. And then the last, 7 root 7 times uh, root 7 is plus 7 square root of 49. Okay, these two middle terms are called like terms, and even though there's no number out in front of the square root of 35, we can think of it as 1 times square root of 35, plus 8 times square root of 35, or times, <laughs> plus 7 times the square root of 35 equals 8 square root of 35. I was jumping ahead of myself. So we have 5 plus 8 square root of 35, and then square root of 49 is just 7, so we get 7 times 7. Well, that's going to be 5 plus 8 square root of 35 plus 49. But these two can go together, and we get 54 plus 8 square root of 35. The square root of 35 doesn't simplify. The only factors are itself and 1 and 7 and 5. Um, so we don't have to do anything else.